Paul. Yes. <laughs> uh, just thinking about those that are mandatory reporters. Yes. <laughs> I wasn't in Squim, Washington, and I spent a lot of time in jail. A lot more time than I would have wanted to spend there. Yes. <laughs> And I, I went through all the paperwork that I had in my portfolio yesterday and really looked at the chronological events that have happened to me over the last two and a half years after I had informed the police departments that the petitioner didn't sign it. You don't give a petitioner a chance to sign it. They have to be there on the day of the court hearing. Yes. They have to sign it before the court commissioner signs the court order. Oh! Now, I've been asking you to remove that protection order so that I could speak to my sons. <laughs> yeah. And then there's the disillusion of marriage where we found out last week yes, <laughs> that I could not contact the pastor at 1023 Kitchen Dick Road or I would have been arrested for trespassing or harassment. Yes. The same individual that used a picture of my sister, Susan Bowers, as if she were Marilyn Van Proyen. Oh. <laughs> Now, I don't know exactly what the reluctance is on the part of law enforcement yeah. <laughs> to enforce child exploitation laws, child abuse laws, <laughs> but as an American citizen, I wanted to speak to Marilyn for the last year. <laughs> In fact, I told her to call me uh, when she sees Mike go to jail in handcuffs. <laughs> I told her that I love her. <laughs> now, did you want to arrest anybody today, or were you just going to put me in jail again? I think there should be a rule that before courts send any notices or any other official confidential documents to an address, <laughs> they need to check with the respondent to make sure that they can communicate with the individual at that lo lo location. <laughs> now, I know. You're there in Washington, D.C. <laughs> you just got uh, a tummy tuck, did you? <laughs> Do you wear glasses? I mean, considering where you would want to have your business. <laughs> have you heard of Google Glasses? Yes. <laughs> well, the CIA over the last 20 years has kind of developed some top secret glasses. Yes. <laughs> Where they don't call them Google Glasses, they're just, they look like regular glasses, but you got a little screen in them because the, the temple is used as a type of antenna. Yes. Could you get me the optometrists and all of those that have had eye surgery that happen to be employees of this government? Yes. And then all of those in the financial district of London that had to have top secret glasses that were connected to a supercomputer so they could see a screen on the inside of the lenses. Now, I know. You don't like wearing glasses. My, I, I, I understand that you dislike the whole thought, but why don't you get me the contact lenses? Because as I remember it, there was some infrared contact lenses. <laughs> kind of like you could put a lizard in your ass. Yes, you could connect the, your ass to a satellite and then you could see infrared. Oh my golly, pouch! So just give me the last 60 years of individuals that have employed in Washington, D.C. and every contact lens, every pair of glasses, then give me all the breast enhancements and your dick's not working the way that it used to. Give me all the prescriptions for Cialis, ouch, Viagra, ouch. I just want to know how many of those in office have a little problem with penis dysfunction. Cha -cha 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 -cha. Now, when you get your prescriptions, <laughs> considering that you're a federal employee of the United States of America, the whole thought that you needed a hard dick while working for the federal government <laughs> seems reasonable, unless, of course, <laughs> you weren't getting your blue pills from some foreign nation. Poach, I just want to know, of all of those that are mandatory reporters, how many have erectile dysfunction? Check have a problem seeing because their eyesight's not so good pooch how many of them thought that we only employ those that have breast implants pooch you remember the turbo tits i told you about where you have your tits removed and you put new ones in the oh 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 top secret financial this is bomb now i'd like to know Exactly. Uchum Central Intelligence Agency. You oh you got elected to office and see oh, there's not a lot of a you're <laughs>